the truth. Stop. If you're not already subscribed, hit that big red button down below. Turn on, uh, click on that gray bell, turn on notifications, drop a like on this video, and leave any comments suggesting any year nays, topics, or anything. Deji versus Vinny Hacker. This is another, yeah. this is like the Taylor Holder versus Gibb fight. D yeah, yeah there another was a, YouTuber from the UK. Yeah, and there was a... The whole nation. Yeah, the whole King nation. Size brother, Deji. There was a favorite in that fight, too, like a strong favorite for Deji yeah, to win. Yeah, Deji. Like... Even 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 after the weigh-in where we saw he wasn't in that bit, a lot of people were saying physique isn't everything. Deji sells great boxing technique, and even if his cardio isn't as good as maybe someone like Vinny's, it's you could still be much better than it used to be. But if, unfortunately, that wasn't the case it, in the his fight. His cardio failed him. Yeah, the first yeah. two rounds, like like also another thing was Vinny looked much better than anyone expected he looked better than every single tiktoker there except taylor holder but even on that but on that night he was a better fighter than taylor holder because he came out with the win and taylor holder did yeah. as we'll talk about more when we talk about he that is fight. the only tiktok win isn't yeah he? at least he brought you know he didn't he brought some glory to tiktok at least yeah. he brought a little bit but he he definitely I feel like Deji in the first round at least he lo Deji looked better in terms of technique but Vinny he had a heart and he was still good he was still he still had technique he's uh, he was more like the guy to he wasn't as consistent he was just, he was more like throw out combos while Deji's the opposite I feel like he throws out more consistent punches he doesn't go for combos as much and he, he definitely I think the another Deji definitely looked better especially since he used to play orthodox but uh fighting style but that wasn't his strength so he switched to southpaw which is his strength which is like uh, leading towards left hand punches but i don't know i think and then i think that after, even on the second round like both were close but i think you could even you could both i'd say they slightly lean both towards deji but you know you could probably give at least one of them to Vinny. but even like the third round those when I think yeah. we all knew that the fight was over because before the round even started, Deji he took a, he took knee. a knee. He, and he gave up his car in the middle of the He fight. didn't give up his body. He, he gave, gave up, up on bro. him. He didn't and give so up. He g Wait, what are you talking how about? Do you he gave up in the third round. He's like, I can't do this. No, he didn't. And then he, what are you talking yeah, about? Except nah, he, he his up. body gave up. He he didn't need because he wanted to forfeit. You think he want, He's Deji's not that type of person. Deji did not give up. His body was not oh. prepared for that onslaught of punch. The like of who like Vinny is as a fighter, and his body just wasn't prepared for the fight in general. He did not give Bro, up. I can definitely he say gift, that. He I would his body definitely disagree. The way he he took a knee trying to rest, and then when he stood up, you could see his mentality and his body. I like, mean. He took his in body. The punches, I think he bro, put his Deji, hands up. His yeah, his yes, body gave up on him. Yeah, so that's what I'm saying. He, he gave up. his body giving up is not him giving up. Him giving up is saying I I quit. I'm not gonna do this. If he's giving up, he would not have continued. His yeah, body I mean, failed him, and we saw that right after the knee. He actually didn't look that bad. He looked like Vinny was still looking like he was winning that round. But wouldn't Deji he take off a point? I mean, like doesn't could. Vinny get points for if he got no? Yeah, down, Deji which... gets a point off. So. Yeah, yeah, that's so... already that's already a bad thing. And then we saw near the middle of the third round, Vinny landed a, the the best combo of the fight. Deji got an eight count because of it. He was just he was froze like he did in the Jake Paul fight. He just froze. He wasn't trying to counter. And I think that's partially yeah, that's, due uh, to his. I don't I don't think that was due to him giving up. I think it was partially due his body. He knew that his body wasn't good for it. So I think he just was thinking too much about that, and he froze. I think he did, like a bunch of the know. fighters did. I, he didn't give up. You're very optimistic in up. what you say, Oshawa, when it comes to you. None of the fighters in this but... fight gave up. Like no, he, he didn't give up, but he, like him, not doing anything afterwards. We're just standing and taking. That's not him in. giving First, up. That's just him freezing. That's not the ref. Hey, freezing. He's... Free, freezing in a fight is not giving up. It's just usually you freeze maybe in the beginning of a fight. Not no, in the most fight. people won't freeze in the beginning because they still have that adrenaline. It's one. Not in the very beginning, Wait. but maybe the first couple of rounds is when you'll see them freezing. Not in the usually the first round, you won't see someone be like freeze. Like you see that saw that with the Michael Lee versus Jarvis fight. He Michael Lee was still in the first round, still fighting back, right? But the second round, I think it sank in that he's in a boxing match and he's losing. So I yeah, think that affected he, him. So that same thing you know with Deji. He you realized his cardio. That's probably the same thing happened because Michael Lee, when he came off the bench, he 
didn't seem as motivated anymore because of what he he thought of yeah. what just happened. He definitely didn't he, give up, but I think he let the pressure like affect get him. to him. That's what yeah. happened to. That's Deji what happened too. with. Like, the, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Give up exactly. But, like his P just like didn't try anymore because I wouldn't he say he didn't try. I just don't think he was able to try because his, his cardio wasn't good. But I think that's what I say. I, he yeah. couldn't like uh, try so. He went down. I mean, yeah. he didn't even go down. Vinny landed a second. The there. Yeah, very good combo. Deji froze yeah. and couldn't throw back, and the ref ended the fight. But here's the thing Deji only had three months to. He was overweight, and he limited himself. Like, he already lost 25 pounds in three months while he yeah. was already training for boxing. It was just not solely focusing on losing weight. So that is very good. And yes, it's, it's not an excuse because honestly, he and mainly his team too. Yeah. I don't. I think he needs to get a new. You know team. what gassed him out? Honestly, he, he, what gassed him out is that he was the shorter person in this fight, and he was the aggressor in the yeah, first. Yeah, he was aggressive. He needed to. He needed to more like gauge Vinny's skill instead of going in right yeah. away because no one knew like what Vinny looked like. He didn't. Have you know, any he was dressed. Uh, so his dress was unorthodox. It was like different than anybody else. He had a white towel. But I mean, yeah, like that's what that's is, is what Mike, Mike Tyson, Tyson did. Yeah, so, yeah, Mike Tyson. Wore, I feel, I'm not gonna lie. It definitely looked a bit. Yeah, it looked a bit. It didn't look. It didn't look as good. That, but well, yeah, I think it's the more like thing like, oh, I I'm the uh, upper dog in this fight, and I'm gonna win. Yeah, but I, I don't need uh, the, yeah. like a fancy thing. I just, I'm good. But unfortunately, that didn't play out that but way. Uh, maybe we'll I mean, see him he's... back again. He's he has like. Again, he didn't have much time to lose weight. I think he needs a new team, losing two fights already with the same team. And like his team didn't focus more on like the cardio as they should have. I think they, as a, as a group, they should have focused more on the cardio than the boxing technique. Because I think if Deji had just a bit more cardio, well, not a bit more, but better cardio, he could have won that fight for sure. Yeah. So, but, you know, Deji said he's going to be all off. It's not all about media. the looks. Yeah. Uh, what would sure. it uh even name? if he wasn't having a six pack, he still could have had yeah, better cardio. Yeah. But uh, I think we'll Tyson see him. Tyson Fury's father is like fifty years old. He's not in shape, and he could run ten miles easily. And Tyson Fury himself is doesn't look 20, in shape. Yeah, but he's, one of he's the not greatest in shape. He could run twenty time. miles. It's just about uh, not. It's about it's about how you if you get used to it. If he ran, he if doesn't have to like. Bet does not mean a six pack. Yeah, it just means uh, your what your body's physically able to do. Yes, I mean exactly. depends on which way you view it. So if you're fit just for pictures, where you just yeah. are skinny and yeah, that's different type of fit. And for this fight, I like I felt bad for Dead G Man. I like I really a lot of people wanted did, yeah. him to you win. saw it in the Twitter replies. He was calling himself a yeah. failure, and a lot of people were supporting him. So I think that's yeah, and it's helping him like fair play uh, to Vinny Hacker, yeah. as you said before. Uh, like he really. The cons- what is it the word to say he was like to Deji uh, he's he not, really helped he, Deji yeah he was he called, right after the fight ended you know Deji was saying to himself saying to Vinny even Vinny came to his yeah. corner like I'm a failure like all that and you know Vinny respected comforted, Vinny yeah, he was comforting true. Vinny uh, Deji yeah. and he was telling him he's not a failure you come back from this and he said the same thing on Twitter after the fight so I think yeah. De- Vinny even before the fight a lot of people saw him as the most respectful TikToker, him and Taylor Holder. So I think, you know, after this fight, that proved like Vinny was definitely a, a guy like a guy that all the YouTube fans he's could respect. 18, and, like, bro. I, he's I'm 18. Not, he's, like, he's mature for an 18 year old. He's the, he's yeah. younger than Ned. He's going to have to come for him. That really shows his maturity. And I'm excited to see him yeah. fight again because I definitely think he can.